All right, we are here with uh, two of the stars of the film, The Long Dark Trail, Carter and Brady O'Donnell. Uh, guys, what did you think of the film? It was great. It was awesome. Completely blown away. I mean, you know, the fact that we worked on it um, kind of gives us a little um, bias towards it, but I, I mean, I was still really impressed. Yeah, I, I honestly, I couldn't have said it better. So you're sitting in the in the audience, uh, you know, you get a nice ovation pre-show when, when Nick and Kevin come out and kind of introduce everything, but what was going through your mind the first time that you saw yourself actually up there on the big screen? We went and watched it a few weeks ago when it was finished, um, and my, I guess my initial reaction um, was shock, but not, not in a bad way. I, I mean, a mix of shock and pride in myself, I guess. Yeah, and it's, uh, it's a little surprising, it's a little weird, but it's fun too, because you get to remember all the moments that happened while we were Well, filming. exactly. I mean, when, when we filmed it versus when we saw it, there was a, almost a year time difference, so it was, it was nice to kind of get taken back to those moments. So tell me a little bit about how you guys got involved in this film. You know, how did how did these guys at 418 first approach you about about being in this movie? Well, um, Kevin's family and my family are both locals of Warren County. Have um, have family members that have lived here for many years. So we've always kind of known each other. But Kevin saw Brady and I in a all county musical, which is a Warren County thing, um, and he knew us and was already thinking of doing the Warren project at the time and figured a script with two brothers played by two brothers was a uh, good route to take. Uh, and so tell me a little bit about that. I know Kevin had mentioned to me, you know, at some points during the filming, he said to you guys, what would you say if it was just your brother that you're talking to? How, how much did that play in his, you know, getting comfortable with delivering the, the lines and the dialogue in, in the filming? I think once we read through it enough and um, got a thorough understanding of our characters, the rest kind of fell into place because, yeah, it, it would be some, it, some of those things would be the um, things I would actually say to him if we were in that situation. The script was pretty natural. It flowed very well. Yeah. Uh, so we just had a special screening here. Uh, the Strothers Library Theater was almost completely full. Did you expect that kind of turnout? Uh, yeah, I, I expected it. Um, yes, but no. I mean, I, it was like uh, we didn't. I didn't. I expected it to be full, but I didn't really understand the true amount of people that was. Because we've had what over 500 people here today, and that was incredibly surprising. Right around 500. When we finally yeah. got everyone in, and that was really surprising. Really yeah, I think that. Um, I knew it was going to be a good turnout of people we knew, but just random faces that I've seen maybe once or twice in my life that still came out was really impressive. So were there were there any nerves when the when the lights went down for the first time and the film's about to start of, oh, I hope people like this, or were you guys pretty confident that, that it would go over well? I'm not going to lie, I was pretty confident all the way in, but yeah, with those first few minutes, I was a little nervous, and um, as it went on, I was like, all right, it seems like people are into this, and yeah, my confidence grew with time. Yeah, and, and I, I knew beforehand that like everyone would, would enjoy it, even if if they had a higher expectation, which is which is expected because they've never they've never really seen something like that here. So exactly. Yeah, but I'd say it turned out a lot. Uh, and then you know to get the the reaction, you get you know nice applause at the at the film's conclusion. Uh, how did that make you guys feel? Overwhelmed with joy. That's yeah, just the, that, the support of everybody the for us, it. for Kevin, for the families, um, the amount of people who helped make it possible just by, hey, can we use your axe? Hey, can we use the back of the draft house? Like, <laughs> it, it's all so much love and yeah, we had happiness so going around. And it wouldn't have happened without Yeah, I, I don't think support. I've stopped smiling since the lights came up, honestly. <laughs> Uh, you guys mentioned you had done some some stage work previously, you know, the All County Musical and things like that. How much different was this to be shooting a film as, as compared to doing something on stage? So with on stage, you kind of have to face a certain direction so the audience can see you. Um, and in film, the camera is sort of facing your direction. You know, they they place what. They, they can do over and over again what they want you to see. Um, and 
out there you practice over and over again what you hope you can pull off for everyone to see. And I mean, nine times out of ten you do it, but still that is a big difference. Yeah, and on stage it's all like there's all these tricks and it's kind of like fake, but it's meant so that the audience from their perspective it all looks real. And in, in the film it, you don't have that, you just do the scene as it's supposed to be done because you've got those resources and you don't have to try and bring in these big things, you go to them. And so that just openness and difference is, is the spot. And what was it to what was it like to work with, with Nick and, and Kevin on this film? They're awesome. Like I, I don't think I could yeah. say anything else about it. They're two amazing people, two amazing film I mean I can't even call them directors because they do so much more they than just that. So um and they were great, and they would always congratulate us, like, oh, that scene is so good. So we, supportive. I don't think that they understand that they are most of this film, that that's all, so much of them, and I think they need to realize Yeah, I really appreciate them so much. Oh, my God, yeah, I love them. All right, so you just finished your first feature film. Is, is this the genesis of future for, for the O'Donnell boys? Are we going to see you on the big screen again? If it opens some doors, I would not complain. By yeah, any means. I, I think Kevin might might have some other plans. We haven't talked about it too much. But. I mean, and I, I kind of go to school for this sort of thing, so Kevin and I have already talked about working for internships and uh, interviews later on down the road. But, yeah, if something like this would work out, no complaints from me. All right, Brady and Carl O'Donnell, stars of The Long Dark Trail, thank you guys so much for joining us. Anytime. Thank you.